Hello, FAR members. Welcome to another edition of Locked In with Kim. I am very pleased to be joined today with, by Jennifer Sloat, who is with one of our wonderful affiliate marketing partners, Kay Havnanian Homes. So, Jennifer, thank you so much for being with us today. And how are you surviving the lockdown? Oh, thank you so much for having me. We are surviving in style, that's for sure. <laughs> I, I do love the side pony. <laughs> Okay. So one thing I've been I've been thinking while I'm filming these is I didn't want to be in the same room all the time, so I've been moving it around. And I imagine that there's lots of people like me who are looking at my stuff, my kitchen, and thinking, oh, if only I had a bigger island, and if only oh, no. we had this in the basement. And I love one of those mud rooms with the the cubby holes. So quarantine is making me sick of my own four walls. So if I did want to <laughs> upgrade and change my home, how are things going at KHOP? Are you still selling? Are you still building? Talk to us about how you all are adjusting to the crisis. So let me first say uh, it's, that you're absolutely right as far as the backgrounds and stuff, because I've noticed myself on virtual meetings, looking at other people's like knickknacks and stuff in the background. So I totally feel you. I'm like, oh, I love that. <laughs> or the bigger island. And um, we're actually using that a lot to our advantage from the virtual aspect. And I, and I think realtors could benefit from that as well. Maybe you're doing your uh, showing at your open house and you're recording it and you're posting it on your social media. And people are looking at the internet more than ever before. Um, and home has become so important. Home is really, obviously, it's always been where the heart is, but now we're stuck in it and we're looking at it in a different way than we ever did. And, you know, some of the things that we're doing to use that to our advantage is creating videos that can be shared that show how home is enjoyed. As a matter of fact, nationally, we just did one of homeowners enjoying their brand new house, you know, whether it's outside in their yards or at their big 10 foot island, or we have what's called a hob hub, which is a really cool space where you can work from home. Um, so we've been doing a lot of featured social media ads, a lot of virtual appointments and really getting creative. And I think some of this stuff is really going to stick around after it's over. Yeah, absolutely. So what is the process now? If an agent walks in with a client, first of all, can you walk in to the models and tour them? And then if you do decide you want to write a contract on a house, it, are there any delays because of COVID-19? Are your work crews adjusting anything because of the restrictions? Talk to us about that. Oh yeah. So uh, it's a big question, but I'll try to answer it in pieces. So the first part, as far as being able to enter our models, absolutely. We are open for business. Um, what we are asking is that folks set an appointment um, there. They can call any of the numbers on our website. Um, so there's a toll-free number that they can call. I apologize. I should have probably written that down. We'll make sure we get that up at the end. I'll have, I'll have us put a graphic up with that information. That's perfect. Okay, yeah. great. So there's definitely a toll-free number they can call to call our national CIS. They're open till about nine o'clock Eastern time. So you can set an appointment, you know, for the next day in the middle of the night if you wanted to. You can also call our communities directly. Um, you can also even pull up to our communities. We are truly open 10 to 6 daily, um, and that's Sunday to Sunday. And you can pull up to the communities. There will be a flyer on the door, and it just says a number that you can call. All they're going to do is just make sure that you're not ill. Um, and then they'll essentially they'll welcome you into the model. Um, once you're in the model, you'll have a tour six foot apart, <laughs> um, and it'll be a nice one-on-one -on -one moment. Um, the other things that can be done is we're offering virtual appointments. You can call that same toll-free number or any of our on-site communities found right at khop.com and um, you can set up a virtual appointment, which is really awesome. And then my absolute favorite piece for you guys um, to answer how can real, what if a realtor can't come there? Maybe they're, they themselves are ill, but they still have clients that they're still trying to take care of. Or maybe they have a family member they're taking care of and they just can't be at the appointment. Unusual times call for unusual measures. And one of the things that we've enacted is a rapid registration. So um, there will be a form that I will actually send to uh, Kim. Uh, I can send it to you if you like. But again, all they do is call that same toll-free number. They can register their client for 30 days. Um, they mentioned the community of interest. So let's just say, for example, it was Leland Station in Stafford, very popular community. Um, they could put the community of interest down, but that registration is good for 30 days at all of our communities throughout Virginia. Um, so it is a great way. It's a free service. All you do is call the number, give them your customer's name and um, your name, of course, in the community of interest, and they'll have you um, sign the registration, uh, DocuSign virtually. And uh, then once the customer comes in, the customer will sign a copy of the registration as well, acknowledging that you are their realtor. Um, so that's a great way you can handle that. And then as far as from the building aspect for the delays question, 
you know, I, we haven't experienced it yet, thankfully. Um, home building is classified as an essential business. That's why we are able to stay open and help people, you know, make home a better place during quarantine. Um, but we haven't experienced delays yet, but it wouldn't surprise me as we progress through this if you get some, um, but it hasn't happened yet. Okay, that's good to hear. Mm -hmm. um, so I know that it hasn't happened yet. However, and if you saw the March numbers that we posted the other day, I mean, they were good. But I know a lot mm -hmm. of realtors are concerned about that pipeline, right? Looking at a month, six weeks, eight weeks down the road, are you anticipating or is, are, is KHA preparing for that pipeline maybe to contract slightly as, depending on how long this drags on? Because I've always thought about home purchases like, if, if I'm going to make a huge purchase like this, I want to think that tomorrow is going to be at least as good as today, if not better. And obviously that's really been turned on its head in the last couple of months. Yeah. You know, it's such an interesting piece of mine. It, it, it certainly can't happen for certain customers. Um, but what I would say to folks that are thinking like that, especially from a sales aspect side, you know, when we think like that, does it make us a victim or a victor? And ultimately, eight months from now, when Timmy needs that fourth bedroom for the baby that's on the way, that circumstance is still the same. And at any time in, in society, it's we could lose our job at any moment. There's no guarantees for tomorrow at any time. Um, so what we tend to figure out, though, is we figure out how to make our lives work regardless. I'm sure we've all been through a hardship a tough time. A lot of you probably listening to this call have been through the 2008 turndown and people still need homes to improve their lives. And that ultimately is why people choose to purchase a home. And if you have a customer that wants to improve their life, there's no better time than right now. It's just like Warren Buffett says, be greedy when everyone else is fearful and take advantage of those great interest rates. Because what do you think is going to happen when the DOD travel ban lifts or when um, all of this goes away? They're starting to say even today in the news that they're going to start reopening our, our country. Um, there are signs that it's going to happen towards the end of this month. And when supply and demand, it's business 101, what's going to happen when everybody else is looking at the same house that you are? Inventory restraints, as you know, Kim, were already incredibly low um before this happened um the inventory is getting even more low because you will have some builders khab is not one of them i can tell you we're actually actively trying to purchase land um but you will have some builders that are smaller that maybe don't have the the buying power or the you know the economics to be able to do it and it's going to tighten down even further the inventory issues sure. and you're going to have your client that said i you know i wanted to wait that still needed that fourth bedroom He's going to be competing with a lot more people when the gates open. Sure. So there's a lot of things that can be done to protect them. Like, for example, KHAV, we have a 35-day finance contingency. You know, that gives them an additional 35 days of, 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 of a warm safety blanket, if that makes sense. And yes. I know in the general brokerage contracts, you guys have a lot of addendums out there, too. And so what I would say is if you have a customer that wants to improve their life, now is the time to act. Yesterday was the time to act, and, and any crisis can happen at any time. So I would just say, um, if you're focused on improving people's lives, then whatever happens is going to be the best thing that could happen for them. So that's a great segue into the, the last thing we'll talk about before we say goodbye is mm -hmm. if we have our members out there who have clients who are looking to build, you all have a great promotion going on right now. So tell us about that great promotion. So we actually have another one, Kim, that we just got today that I'm very happy about. I didn't get a chance to tell you about this part. I apologize. Um, but it is hot off of the presses. Um, so KHAB Manian, you know, we've always done a hometown heroes program for military and um, certain doctors and things like that. But we've decided to expand this program through the 26th to our today's modern hero, uh, the essential employees. Maybe it's a grocery room stalker. Maybe it's an Amazon employee. There's so many of those folks moving into this area. Uh, maybe it is uh, the, you know, the, the person working at the Lowe's. It could be anybody that's considered an essential employee right now. We're offering through the 26th of April an additional $2,500 any way they want it. Maybe it's closing costs so that they have more money in their pocket. Uh, maybe it's off the price of the home. This is a huge thing that we're really expanding and really trying to say thank you to the unusual heroes that we're seeing today. So that's, that's one thing that's for right. clients. Um, but here's the piece for the agents, um, and I'm really excited to be able to offer this. So we talked about the rapid registration piece. 
Mm -hmm. um, the first realtor um, that calls me, or if we get a bunch of realtors, I would love to have it. But uh, the first realtors that call me at 703-817-8049 to set up an appointment for any of our communities in Virginia, um, I will make sure that when they keep that appointment, they get dinner or a lunch pickup for up to a family of five for themselves, um, just as a thank you from Panera. And uh, I think it's a pretty cool way to, for us to say thank you and give back to you all. And we would love to see uh, the, some appointments be made with our new rapid registration. And come see us at KHOP. We're keeping it safe. We've got lots of disinfectant. <laughs> well, that is a great way to end this. So, Jen, thank you so much for your time this morning. Thank you to KHOP Nanian for being a great supporter of FAR, one of our fabulous affiliate marketing partners. And we will see you soon. You stay Thanks, safe. Jen. You too, okay. Pam. Bye-bye.